I'm excited for this one tonight. Two of these boxes I haven't opened in probably close to a year. Uh, 2020 stuff. We opened quite a bit of 2021 Chrome, but it's been a while since we've been looking after the Luis Roberts and the Boba Shit pure Chrome rookies. Of course, you got Jordan, Randy Rose Arena. Got some various ones. I think Randy's going to be a split card in here tonight. If I remember correctly, I think if you pull him in Topps Chrome, he's going to be Cardinals. And then Topps Update will be uh, <clears throat> Rays. But anyways, we'll get there when we get there. There's your 2020 Topps Chrome pack odds. This is out of a hanger box. Prism Reactors are 1 in 6 packs. Uh, man, they definitely up the odds this from 2020 to 2021. Got a lot better chance last year of getting something crazy. And what's crazy is like you get these boxes for less money last year. So you could get a crazier card for less money uh, more frequently. And this year you can get less crazy cards uh, for more money less frequently. So it's getting a little rough out there. But I don't know. The market will... Market always correct itself. So boxes may release, you know, at like 25 bucks, and uh, very likely that you could see them on the market for like 15 bucks after a while. But anyways, uh, we do have some uh, Tops Update exclusive packs in here as well. But let's go ahead and get started. I'm honestly not sure how long this break is going to take. They did the boxes different last year too. They they don't have the wrap around them. I kind of like that. I feel like. Uh, the wrap could just be like slid off but anyways we're gonna start with 2020 we're gonna start with what i think is the best stuff see if we can't pull some some of those big 2020 rookies right off the bat all right we got uh, lights can be a little bit of a problem but ozzy albies matthew boyd uh, alex young rookie for the Diamondbacks and a Chris Paddock Future Stars for the Padres. Jack Flaherty, Jose Abreu, Manny Machado, and Nolan Arenado. 35th anniversary. Kind of a nice looking card there. Alright, Robbie Ray for the D-backs. Got Max Muncy. Uh, oh, nice. Flagero Jr. Cup card. That'd be like his second year card there. We have a Refractor AJ Puck rookie for the Athletics. We pulled his autograph last night out of uh, Optic Baseball. Out of a solo box. Now, the Refractors are not numbered in regular top scroll. Uh, they should be if we get them in uh, update, though. We should see some numbered ones if we find a refractor in Top Scroll update. It's kind of weird how they do that, but... Anyways. Alright, let's keep it moving. Uh, there's Mike Trout. Austin Meadows. Uh, Luis Castillo. And I think we have a Prism Refractor. A rookie of Abraham Toro. Seems like our only rookies are either Refractors or Prism Refractors. Abraham Toro for the Astros. I got a Jaleo Armenteros. I got good at pronouncing the name last year, but I forgot it since then. Ronald Guzman. Uh, Christian Yelich. And a Boba Shet. 35th anniversary rookie card. Nice. Yeah, I'm not sure how long this break's going to take. I, I expected 40 minutes, but I, 
always forget with Topps Chrome, they actually they have like four or five packs within the hanger box, so it's kind of different. Panini, you get like one big old cellophane pack. You got a Brenham K, Ersa's Aquino, Kyle Lewis, there's Boba Shit. Jesus Lazardo. These are just the uh, National Baseball Baseball Card Day. These are like the preview cards for uh, update. So, anyways, let's go. Uh, let's go twenty twenty one. Let's try to mix it up a little bit here. Bounce back and forth. I love the way those are packaged. Like, I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of the big cellophane pack. The way Panini does it. I feel like the cars get damaged uh, quite a bit easier. But got a Chris Wubik rookie. Evan Longoria. Evan White rookie for the Mariners. And Leody Tavares is our prism refractor. with my sleeve in there. Oh, there's a Casey Mize rookie. Will Smith. Jeff McNeil. And a Max Kepler refractor. Marcelo Zuna. Uh, Andres Jimenez, there's a Luis Robert Cup card, and a Sixto Sanchez, 35th rookie. Ramon Laureano, Trevor Story, Jordan Alvarez, wrong year there, it's a second year card of him. And a Smiley Grundahl uh, baseball insert. A Nick Magical rookie for the White Sox. Luis Reyes. JT Romuto. And a refractor of Trevor Story. So we got uh, one hanger box. I think we had two refractors and a prism refractor, which for 2021, that's not. Not too bad on the odds there. Alright, let's do some update. I think update actually has some color in it, if I remember correctly. I need to let you guys look at the box odds, too, for this. You can screenshot it. Not a lot going on here with the box odds, but you can screenshot that in case you want to uh, do some of your own calculations or figure out if you want to buy some of these boxes. I don't know what they're priced at right now. I imagine they're like just north of $20 a piece. They haven't changed much uh, since I bought them last year. I think I paid like $21 per for these. It's kind of weird I have to open them like this. There's probably a better way to do it, but... Oh, gosh, there was a better way. <laughs> it's like a... I'll open it from the other side, I guess. It's like a blockade down there. Shall not pass. Guess I'll know for next time. Open it from the bottom. Honestly, I don't remember the last time I opened these. I think they might have a bonus pack in there, too. Alright. Oh, yeah, it should be the bonus pack with the parallel. Here we go, 2020 Chrome update. Yeah, David Ortiz. Should be some all-star game cards and home run derby cards. Eric Davis. There is a Kyle Lewis rookie for the Mariners. And a Mike Trout. It's nice to stock up on some Mike Trout Chrome cards. No, they're not like rookies or inserts. But we got Aaron Judge. 
Uh, nice Juan Soto. Decades next insert. It's Joey Votto. And Aaron Judge. This set, honestly, is not great. 2021 Chrome update makes this set look pretty bad, but got Starlin Castro, Cody Stashak, Aristides Aquino rookie, and a Nick Turley rookie. But if you pull one of the big rookies, like Parallel of some sort, it's plenty worth it. Josh Taylor rookie. Uh, Chipper Jones numbers game insert. Got a size knee rookie for Houston. And Eric Mejia rookie for the Royals. Nothing too crazy so far. Probably the Bo Bichette 35th is my favorite card that we've gotten so far. Jonathan Villar, David Price, Todd Frazier, CJ Crone. That was a sorry pack. All right, two exclusive pink refractor cards. So at least we'll get a little color of some sort. Tino Martinez for the Yankees and Todd Frazier for the Reds. Not going to get too hyped for those, unfortunately. I think one time I did a bonus box with a Topps Chrome update hanger, and we pulled uh, Randy Rosarina pink. I think that's about the crazy pink I got. All right, let's run back over to uh, 2020 regular Chrome. Pick up the knees from the top. Yeah. They do a little side load on those. You can get them out from the top. Come on with the good is Luis Robert Super Fractor. Please. Got Archie Bradley, George Springer, uh, Ermin Marquez for the Rockies, and a Kesson Hura 35th anniversary for the Brew Crew. J.D. Martinez, uh, Austin Nola, rookie for the Mariners. Got Willie Adamas for the Rays. And oh, I do have a refractor. Gio Urshela for the Yankees. Refractors uh, for 2020 look a bit more, like, relaxed compared to 2021. Like, they don't stand out quite as, as much. Uh, Joy Gallo, Bobby Bradley rookie, Rowdy Telez, Prism Refractor, Upside Down, Walker Bueller. I didn't know Walker Bueller played at Vanderbilt. A lot of good pitchers come through Vanderbilt. But it wasn't always like that, supposedly. I think, like... I want to say that documentary I was watching said like David Price was kind of the poster boy for coming to Vanderbilt and turning that school around for, for being like a pitching school. Shin Su Chu, Abraham Toro rookie, uh, Adalberto Mondesi, and hey, Luis Robert, 35th. He dude looks like a beast in this photo. Just a tank at the plate. All right, last chrome pack out of this box. Reese Hoskins. You got Justin Dunn for the Mariners. Dansby Swanson, he was a first pick. In like 2015. And you got Albert Pujols refractor uh, for the Angels. And then we'll have some preview cards of some sort. Tops Gallery or something. Uh, maybe just regular tops. Got Aquino, 
There's Kyle Lewis. There's a Jordan. You got Nico Horner and Gavin Lux. I don't know if these cards have increased in value at all. I think when I we were opening this stuff pretty frequently last year, it was you have to sell like five or six of one player to get a couple bucks out of it. All right, 2021. I did list a break of uh, 2022 20, Series 1. I only got that listed. I don't know if it's live yet or not, but we'll break that on Saturday. Got Lewis Brinson, Shane McClanahan rookie, Austin Riley, and a Cabrian Hayes, 35th rookie. Now, all of our decent player rookie cards we're getting are. The uh, 35th anniversary inserts, which are fairly common, if I remember correctly. All right, Jose Altuve. Uh, Luis Castillo, Prismic Power. I see some white. I think we have a backwards card. Let's see here. I don't see the autograph information. Yeah, I think it's just a numbered card out of 399. Kenta Maida. Maybe a magenta or a speckle. It's just a magenta. Not the greatest card, but nice to get a little numbered card there. We got a Future Stars Dylan Cease for the White Sox. That's what happened the other day. We pulled quite a few like refractors, prism refractors, different things out of the Topps Chrome break, but they were all like, you know, the lower end players in the set. Austin Hayes, Kyle Tucker. Uh, Steven Strasburg and a JT Real Muto refractor for the Phillies. Yeah, we had we did a uh, eight eight box twenty twenty one tops Chrome break the other day, and like I said, it was as far as like the odds go, we were right there, just beneath the odds for pulling the the amount of refractors and prism refractors we should have, but. Uh, they were all just not the right players, like a bunch of veterans and not really well-known veterans either. But anyways, we got two packs left in this box, and then we'll go back to after some 2020 updates. J.D. Martinez... John Lester, Shane Bieber, and we do have a Dylan Carlson, 35th. I guess that's going to be the theme tonight is we get any of the decent rookies, it's going to be their 35th anniversary card, which, I mean, I like the design. I just like to see something a little bit more wild. Salvador Perez, Cody Bellinger, Clayton Kershaw. Oh, that's a nice card. Got a Luis Robert Prism Refractor, a little second-year Topps Chrome. Prism Refractors, I think, uh, in this 2021 stuff are like 1 in 6 or 1 in 8. Very nice looking card, though. Alright, we got four boxes left. One of each year, or one of each set, and then one extra Topps Chrome update. Uh, I gotta open it from the bottom, I think. this is like this but just the way it is maybe I'm doing it all wrong there's probably an easier way but I only got one more box after this so I can do my research I guess on the next break there's only I mean I guess we open the side no you can't because they're at the bottom I don't know, I guess that's the only, only place you can. No, 
But don't have to worry about people repacking those boxes. Can't really get them open. All right, we got Hunter Pence. Kenta Meta. There's a Bo Bichette, uh Top Scrum Update rookie. And Wilmer Flores. Wilmer. Uh, Jason Kipnis. Got a Jeff Bagwell. Numbers game insert. There's a Randy Rosarina rookie for the Rays. And Neil Walker. Mr. Cortez, rookie. Anthony Rendon. Tommy Pham. I guess we only got three cards in that one. Yeah, Neil Walker was the last pack. Oh, yeah. Oh, Nestor, rookie, but... Only three cards in that one. That's kind of lame. I've had that happen before, but... Maybe we'll get... We got four in here. I was hoping we might get five. Ken Griffey Jr. We got a decades next Rafael Devers. A Mike King rookie. And Cesar Hernandez. Clayton Kershaw. Uh, Anthony Rizzo, all the Cubs guys will still be for the Cubs in these boxes, like Chris Bryant, Rizzo, and Baez. I do have a Gavin Lux rookie. And Alex Bregman. Let's see if we can get some decent paints here. I'm not sure why you put two cards in one pack, but... Hey, there we go. We got a decent pink. Boba shit. And Wilmer Flores. So I guess it's the same like sequencing there as the pack that we got. That was a Boba Shit hanger pack, man. Nice. I heard a story and I didn't follow up to see just how far it went, but I guess his dad, since there's a lockout going on or whatever, the coaches and players are not allowed to like train together or something. So his dad, like, resigned as a coach just so he could train with his boy at home, which I thought was pretty cool, if true. I don't know why it wouldn't be true, but... I mean, most of those guys are in a place where they could quit their job anyways, but I thought that was cool. He just decided to resign so he could train with old Bo. It's crazy to me how many active players had fathers or grandfathers or relatives in general that played in the league. Oh, another pack. Sneaky. That was the that was the juicy pack dude. This is gonna be a Fractor. I wish. Quang Yoon Kim cup card for the Cardinals. I uh, got a rookie William Contreras for the Braves. Oh, it was a... We do have a backwards card. We're going to go from the top, I guess. It's not numbered. So oh, oh, it's Alicia Robert. It's not numbered, so it's either going to be a negative or an autograph. It's got to be a negative then. I hope it is. We pulled an Acuna negative the other day out of one of these boxes. I hope it's a negative. Those things look sick. Yes. Dang, Luis Robert saying your card's been pretty sick tonight. We had a prism refractor a second ago. That is awesome. And then we got Acuna right behind it. I think I saw. Yeah. Very nice. That was that pack that was hiding out in there. Maybe I should start doing that. Only grabbing four, and then we could be superstitious, leave the one behind for a couple seconds, and then, then pull it out. 
can be a good strategy. Baseball is a game of superstition, so we gotta break. We gotta be superstitious when we break it, I guess. Yeah, but the negatives are, I think they're over for Topps Chrome. Let me see. Negative is one in 112 packs. That's a. That's more packs than we're gonna open tonight. So, we gotta get Crochet rookie, Buster Posey, Alex Bregman, and a Shane Bieber refractor. Excellent pitcher. Money Grundahl, Yodi Tavares, uh, Eric Hosmer, and a P. Alonzo, 35th. You know, I complained about the odds in the new 2021 product, but I think our best cards so far have come out of 2021. Will Myers, or all this Chapman. Got a Braylon Marquez rookie for the Cubs. And a Cattell Marte. Uh, baseball insert for the D-backs. All right, last pack here. And then we'll jump back into 2020. Last hope for the Dylan Carlson, Alec Bombs, Cabrera Hayes, Jazz Chisholm type cards. Luis Camposano, Jackie Bradley, Bryce Harper, and a Matt Olson refractor. Alrighty, I don't know if I'll do this. My world. I don't know if I'll do this break again because I don't know that I have the 2020 boxes left. I've got quite a few 2021 hangers, but I don't know if I have enough 2020 to to mix it properly. I may do a cello break. I got some cellos, which are cool. I don't think they did cellos this year for Topps Chrome. But, oh. all right, 2020 update. We'll save the regular Chrome for last. Let me see here. open one way or another. Uh, it is rather annoying. Like I said, I don't know if there's an easier way to do that or not, but they're in there. All right, we got Boba Shet pink and a Boba Shet regular rookie last time, so let's see if we can work on some other guys this time. Domingo Santana. You got a Tatis Jr. Decades Next insert with the old, uh, was that Desert Digital Camo and the Shades? Cameron Maven and Rich Hill. These packs are kind of weird. They're almost like, uh, like long crimp packs. They hang way further than the cards do. Jesus Lazardo, rookie for the Athletics. Got Cal Ripken Jr., uh, Chris Bryant for the Cubs, and hey, Ronald Acuna Jr. All Star Game card. Let me move that stack back there. Get out of my way. Jose Altuve. Got a Mike Piazza numbers game insert. Yadier Molina and Albert Pujols. Albert, I think, is a cardinal on this card. Yeah, it's like a like old throwback card from an all-star game like in 2009 or something. Tina Martinez. Todd Frazier. Got a Johnny Davis rookie for the Rays. 
And Ichiro for the Mariners. Dang, we got another Boba Shet. It's like four Boba Shet rookies tonight across the different products. Eloy Jimenez, Decades Next. Got Jesus Aguilar and Alec Mills, rookie card. Our pinks, our pink refractors, as they call it. Uh, we have a Bryce Harper for the Nationals. Again, these are a lot of like old All Star game cards, and Mariano Rivera uh, for the Yankees. All right, I think we only got like one rookie pink out of the six pink cards that we opened, so that's kind of lame. At least it was a boba shit, but a little tough, tough odds there, I guess. We got one box to go, and then we'll do a recap. 2020 Topps Chrome. I don't know what these boxes run now. I actually think they're cheaper now. I want to say my cost... Uh, for these is like 33 or 35 something like that. I think I've seen some better deals since then, but I haven't bought any more. I just had a few left laying around that we was going to open. All right, last 20 some odd cards here. First star Gretel for the Dodgers. Got Nico Horner for the Cubs. Couple of rookies there. Uh, Masahiro Tanaka for the Yankees. And we do have a Prism Refractor. Uh, Jose Barrios for the Twins. Some of these Twins snagging all these cards. I think they had a Max Kepler Refractor earlier. Kenta Maeda out of three ninety nine. They got the Prism Refractor there. Jose Ramirez, Buster Posey. Got a Babe Ruth a die cut. OPS Plus insert. Honestly, I'm not even sure what all you would call this, but nice insert. And we got a Christian Yelich uh, 35th anniversary card. Let's see if I can sleeve this fairly easily. These die cuts are always a bit tricky. There we go. Oh, Babe Ruth. Can't tell if that's one of those little like fingernail dings or if that's part of the pattern. To the left there. It almost looks like that's where like shade comes into the card. Like they have a darkness area. I'm not certain. I haven't seen enough of these cars to know if that's normal. You see what I'm talking about? Like right there. It kind of arcs. Seen too many of those fingernail dings. To... On cards it looks terrible when they happen. You got a, another Alex Young rookie. Manny Machado. Christian Walker. And Joey Gallo refractor. I need to start flipping these over. I always forget the refractors are upside down. Joey Gallo for the Rangers. 2020 Topps Chrome has not been giving us the, the hits. There's another Vigero Jr. Cup card. You have Luis Castillo. Uh, Matt Dyserke for the Angels. Yeah, let's go ahead and flip this over. Ah, I flipped the one over that doesn't need to be flipped. Jeez. Uh, Future Stars, Carter Cadboom for the Nationals. I don't really know much about him. I didn't really hear his name much last year. I don't know if he's just an average player or what. But All right, we got two packs left. We got a regular pack and then the little uh, art art gallery or tops update whichever one it's going to be i can't remember so hopefully this last pack's got at least a decent rookie in there 
Does the uh, Cardinals Randy Rosarina Topps Chrome card go for more than the Rays Topps Chrome update? Or not? It makes you wonder because uh, this Topps Chrome update card doesn't say like you know, updated, here's the first game he played. It's just like a pure rookie card. But his top chrome would be the first one that came out, so I don't know. Christian Yelich, Nelson Cruz, uh, Gene Segura, and 35th anniversary of Austin Riley for the Braves. They come on pretty strong this year. A lot of people like his play. I think Bo Bichette and the uh, Blue Jays definitely won tonight's break. Yeah, nice. I don't know. We did have a couple nice Luis Robert cards, but we got a gallery in this one. We got Jordan Alvarez, Bellinger, Mike Trout, Acuna. And Fernando. Some decent cards there. Five dollars off. When does it expire? Uh, a year ago. <laughs> uh, I'm not really a Topps Gallery fan, but I do remember pulling a lot of these five dollar off codes last year. Anyways, let's do a little recap. Uh, I'll probably get 40 or so cards here to, for a recap. Refractors, Prism Refractors. Got a couple of what I would consider hits. Um, didn't get any autographs, which I, I can't remember if we had one autograph last break or what, but anyways, we'll do a recap and check it out, see what all was pulled. Uh, and then we'll get geared up for the basketball break. I hate all the debris that comes off of those cars like that. All right, we had a Kentameda. Uh, I believe these are called Magenta. It's out of 399 of 399 uh, a little bit off from the jersey number there you got a dylan c's future stars jtr muto refractor albert pujols refractor luis robert 35th rookie got a walker bueller prism refractor Gio rochella refractor kyle lewis uh, top chrome update rookie juan soto decades next insert for the nationals got a chipper jones numbers game sixto sanchez 35th rookie yes money grundle baseball insert Trevor Story Refractor, Leody Tavares Prism Refractor, a Boba Shet 35th rookie, uh, Abraham Toro Prism Refractor rookie. Got a Vigro Jr. second year cup card, Topps Chrome. Uh, we had another one of these as well. Then an AJ Puck rookie refractor for the Athletics. And Austin Riley, 35th rookie. Uh, Jose Barrios Prism Refractor, Joey Gallo Refractor. Future Stars, Carter Kaiboom. Got a uh, die cut, Babe Ruth. OPS plus insert. Christian Yelich, 35th. Fernando Tatis Jr., Decades Next insert. Boba Shett, Topps Chrome Update rookie. Got a uh, Eloy Jimenez, Decades Next. Bryce Harper, Pink, Topps Chrome Update refractor for the Washington Nationals. Shane Bieber refractor. Pete Alonso, 35th. Matt Olson refractor. Ronald Acuna, 35th. Uh, one of the bigger cards for the rate. Maybe the biggest value-wise. But uh, Luis Robert, uh, second year, tops chrome, negative. One in 112 packs, I think is what we said. Got the nice all-star cup there. Bob Bichette, rookie. Randy Rosarina, rookie. Got a Rafael Devers, decades next. Uh, got a Gavin Lux, rookie. Probably... Probably top three biggest cards of the break here. Got a pink refractor Boba Shit. This may be the biggest one. I don't know exact values on all these cards, but this one and the Luis Robert are probably a couple of the biggest. Dylan Carlson, 35th. Got a Luis Robert Prism Refractor. And a Cabrian Hayes, 35th rookie for the Pirates. Kind of fun to go back and open some older stuff. I wish 20 I wish 2020 we could have had a numbered card or negative or something at least, an autograph. Uh, 2021 was, even though it's got worse odds, supposedly, uh, was the one sending out all the goodies. Th that comes kind of twofold with 2021. I didn't mention this at the beginning, but I believe they put out more parallels. So 
even though you may have tougher odds to get a parallel in general, if you've got more parallels out there available to be pulled, you're probably going to pull them almost as frequently um, as you would, you know, from previous years. So that, you know, that's part of the strategy is just making more different colored parallels so that the odds don't feel as terrible. You don't constantly feel like you're going to hit this. But it's, it's not quite as fun when you pull a card out of, you know, 500 or something, but that's probably what we're going to end up getting to at some point. Just so they can produce more cards, more boxes. All right, we got some basketball now. This break was interesting the other day when we did it. It was, it was very, uh, like, the hoops, the AJ box, the AJ exclusive box is not, it's like, super random but i think in the donner's retail box we got almost every single rookie card that you could get like almost every rookie was a different pool in each pack and there's only like what 50 in the set <coughs> hmm. excuse me i think the only one we missed like his base rated rookie is like denny denny obdia or something like that so <clears throat> anyways a nice clean break if you want to almost uh, you know guarantee that you might get one of your rookie cards so it's, at least that's what it seemed like when we opened this box it was very evenly dispersed except for you know your your floods or your lasers whatever those are called were kind of random so anyways we're going to get started got some of that card debris on the table you probably see that there but uh, eight exclusive parallels. They'll be like red and blue or something like that, I believe. Let me see if I can see. Mm, doesn't say. Here's the back, though. You got 50 base rookies, some hoops tribute cards. Base hyper blue, base hyper red. You can get numbered cards from 99 to 10. If you got the zero gravity inserts. You can get autographs. There's a spark plugs insert. We didn't pull any of those last time. So, anyways, let's get after. It. We'll do this box first. It's only four packs. Uh, we got. I think we had mm, two numbered cards last time. So hopefully we can get some nice, nice numbered cards. I do like these boxes too. They're kind of nice little sturdy boxes. If you want to maybe ship something and back out in them, somebody could have a nice box for their collection and then. You have a good way to protect cards or packs or whatever. Pew. Yeah, it's got like a little pocket there. I think the pocket actually slipped out the back. That should probably be in the front, but and like go into the groove there. But a yeah, nice cool little box. Store some base cards or like I said, ship packs in just like you get the packs out of these. So, anyways, let's get after it. Enough rambling. Show a few base. Um, and hopefully some, some goodies. Harrison Barnes, Rudy Gobert. You got Marcus Smart. Uh, Marcus Morris Sr. And R.J. Hampton, they'll have him on the Nuggets in here since this is like the first release of the the year. Then we got a Tyrell Terry, that's the, I guess, Blue Hyper or something that they call it, the Team All exclusive, one of those parallels. We got a Jason Tatum out of 25, very nice, sweet, nice green uh, team color match too. And then we got a Tyrese Halliburton We Got Next insert. Uh, now playing Devin Vassell and Cassius Winston. Not a bad first pack. Andre Iguodala. 
DeMar DeRozan of the Spurs, Thon Maker, Danny Green, and so it looks like we've got five base vets out of there, Pascal Siakam. Uh, first blue is Fred Van Vliet of the Raptors. We got a rookie of Leandro Balmaro for the T-Wolves. I've never seen that card before. Interesting. Or never, I've never even heard of that guy, I don't think. There's a Lamelo. We got next insert. We have a now playing Onyeka Okongwu. Oh, sweet. What is this? The Legends of the Ball, Scotty Pippen for the Bulls. That's a cool card. Not numbered or anything, but looks like it's kind of maybe a limited card. I don't know. We didn't pull it last time. I know that. It's got a nice little foil to it. Cool. I know some people like, you know, some people dislike Scotty. I don't, I don't really have feelings one way or another. I know he played up the road here like two hours. Uh, college ball, but I was a little bit too young to remember any of that. Not a bad first couple packs. That, I like that Tatum. I think a lot of people are getting mixed feelings about Tatum. I know he was one of like the, the most hyped up players. You know, during 2020, it was like you know, Luca and Trey and some of those guys. And then Tatum was kind of in there, you know, in the second tiered conversation. His cards selling for some crazy amounts. Seems like a lot of people have a problem with his so shot selection here lately. When you don't win, when you're not winning... Going deep in the playoffs with your team, people start questioning your abilities. You got Aaron Gordon, Aaron Baines. They flipped the card here. Malik Beasley, Mitchell Robinson. And it looks like another Tyrell Terry rookie for the Mavericks. Daniel House Jr., one of those blue exclusives. We got Miles Bridges for the Hornets. Aaron Neesmith, we got next insert. A James Wiseman now playing insert. And Patrick Williams now playing. Is he now playing or is he still hurt? I, don't know. I know Kobe White came back like 10, 12 games, I think, before the All-Star break. Jeremy Lamb. Terry Rozier, Jeff Teague, uh, Dwight Powell, and Derek Favors. We got Carl Anthony Towns, your three-point contest champion. That really threw me for a loop. Danilo Gallinari for the Thunder. Another one of those blues. And then we got Emmanuel Quickly we got next. I think we might have another foil back here. Now playing Isaiah Stewart. And nice. Got a now playing uh, foil of Patrick Williams. So the, the two uh, two foil cards we got are both Bulls. Both Bulls cards. And then our numbered card was Jason Tatum for the Celtics. We got, like I said, I think we got two numbered cards. And a high voltage Steph Curry last time. Just one numbered card and two foils this time. It does say you can get autographs on the back of those boxes. I don't know if the autographs are going to be like case hits out of 20 boxes or, if, you know, there might be a couple per case, but <clears throat> maybe we'll get one of those. Now, this Donner's retail box, it does say that you get an autograph per box on average. So I'll let you guys look at the info here. 250 card set. You got 50 rated rookies. <laughs> Now, like I said, this is 24 packs, and we usually get, I think, two rookies per pack. So, um, we pretty much almost got the entire set of rookies last time. So, that may be kind of the motivation behind the retail box, is to really just encompass the whole set. And just get a good look at it with the possibility of getting some rarity. 
uh, with the, I guess, like, green lasers inside. So, anyways, we'll go ahead and bust it open and get rolling. We got some weather coming in tonight. I think we're under a tornado watch. Uh, warning means they've actually spotted one, but a watch just means the conditions are right. So, I think we're okay for now. It's weird having a tornado watch in February, though. Usually we don't start getting that stuff till late March into uh, into April. Oh, it's hard to get my big old fingers back there and get these packs out. Last tornado we had come through town was in 2009. I was like a sophomore in high school and it wiped out the entire middle of the town. Took out the the middle school, I was just out of middle school like two or three years before. I took out the middle school and they had to like travel to go to school for like the next year or so. They would travel to another county and go to like school at some extra buildings that they had out there. So kind of weird. But it took a couple years to get everything kind of rebuilt and back to normal. Hope it never happens again. All right, here we go, Andrew Wiggins, Kevin Love, uh, Victor Oladipo. I'll start getting used to the way these, barely see the names, Clint Capella, Kendrick Nunn. You got a Steven Adams, uh, Power in the Paint insert. And there's a Desmond Bain Raider rookie. And Manuel Quickly, not too bad on those two. Like I said, we usually get two of those ready rookies in every pack. So we could very well almost get every one of them. Alonzo, Gary Harris, Derek Rose, uh, Kyle Kuzma, Jimmy Butler, and we got Darius Garland, Green Laser, second year card there. Zeke Naji and Sadiq Bey, ready rookie. Sadiq Bay and them Pistons. Steven Adams. Steph Curry. Zion. Uh, TJ Warren. Draymond Green. We've got a Luka. Complete players insert. Aaron Neesmith, Raider rookie. And Killian Hayes. I love the Raider rookie. I'm, I mean, I prefer Optic. Just because it is like more of a thicker premium stock card. It's got a little bit of weight to it. And... But, I mean, Donruss is just fine with me as well. I just like the look of it. It's been around forever. My my three-year-old, I almost said two-year-old, he just turned three a couple of days ago. He can say the word Donruss. We talk about it so much in the house. Maverick started reading it. and So Jay's picked up on it. He was opening cards earlier today. I little like, I bought this like big box of like, repackaged stuff. It was it's like a company that repacks cards, but they had like a huge like, liquidation sale. So I bought like a case of it, and it was like twenty or forty packs. Ended up being like a dollar fifty a pack. So I just let the boys open a pack occasionally. Well, they opened one tonight, and Jason's like, "Is that a Donner's card?" He's like three years old. I got to get him in some more hobbies. Can't be card junkies a whole life. Mikel Bridges, Darius Garland, Bama DeBayo, Torian Prince, Tobias Harris. Got a franchise features, Joel Embiid. Patrick Williams, Raider Rookie, and Cassius Winston. So hopefully, I think you, I want to say we got maybe 10 or so of those green lasers. Of course, we should have an autograph in here, too, so we'll have to keep an eye out for that. Hoping we can get some nice green lasers tonight. Eric Paschal, Aaron Gordon, Kevin Herter, Bryn Forbes, Jalen Brown, got a Carl Anthony Towns franchise features, and then a Peyton Pritchard rated rookie, and Tyrese Maxey. Uh, 
Tim Hardaway Jr., Pascal Siakam, Dante DiVincenzo, Joe Ingles, Jeff Teague, got a Killian Hayes, Great Expectations, uh, Grant Riller Raider Rookie, and CJ Ellaby. Yeah, we need a we need one of those green laser Giannis. Then we need a Jordan War rookie of some sort. We need a Ant Man too. Joel Embiid, Damian Lillard, Jonathan Isaac. We got Jordan Poole, Luke Kennard, Green Laser is Al Horford for the Sixers. And Nick Richards, Raider Rookie. Along with Trey Jones. Shake Milton. Jackson Hayes. Uh, Jonas Valanciunas. We got RJ Barrett. Joe Harris. Great Expectations. Uh, Zeke Naji. Got Daniel Toru, rated rookie. And Jaden McDaniels. DeMar DeRozan. Tori Craig. Lori Markinen. Kawhi Leonard. And Giannis. Got a league leaders for the Raptors. Vince Carter, all-time league leaders. Kayla Martin, Raider rookie, and Precious Achua. Boy, we're touching all those Hornets, uh, Donners. We haven't got the Lamello yet, though. Michael Porter Jr., Dennis Schroeder, Julius Randle, Mitchell Robinson, Cam Reddish, uh, Bam and Abayo, Green Laser for the Heat, you got a Cole Anthony rated rookie. And Halliburton. So not too bad out of that pack. Seko Nomboya. Jamal Murray. Wesley Matthews. Marquise Chris. And Danilo Gallinari. Fantasy stars of Nikola Jokic for the Nuggets. Ray rookies are Josh Green and Kira Lewis Jr. Alex Caruso, Paul George, Karis Lovert, Derek White. Duncan Robinson, uh, complete players, Kyrie Irving, Isaac Okoro, rated rookie, and James Wiseman. This almost, I uh, may have said this last time we broke it too, but it almost feels like we just opened a complete set and got a few, like, bonus lasers. It's not a, not a bad thing to get all the different rookies and stuff, but it just feels weird. Like you say, you do get like green lasers. You're supposed to have an autograph in here, along with some various inserts. So, we still need Ant Man, and we still need uh, Lamelo out of here. What's weird is there's 20, 24 packs, and you get two rated rookies at the back of each pack, so there's going to be two rated rookies missing. So you'll have 48 out of 50. So two guys got to sit the bench on, on this box break. I'm hoping that the two guys we miss, we might get hit them on the green lasers. That way we do get all the rookies. There's a Luca. Uh, Marcus Smart, Ennis Cantor, who is this, DeAndre Hunter, Matthew Deladova, hey, there's a Jalen Smith, 
Green Laser Raider rookie. Got a Skylar Maze and Saban Lee. Hey. Sorry, I saw that comment come up pretty late. Oh, I got something shiny in here, too. John Collins. Uh, there's LeBron. Blake Griffin. Brooke Lopez. And Doug McDermott. Got a Joel Embiid Green Laser. Jalen Smith, Radio Rookie. And we did get LaMelo here. Nice. We got about, I don't know, 10 or 12 packs left, it looks like. I can't remember how many Green Laser Radio Rookies we got on the last one, but. Hopefully we get another one. We still got our autograph somewhere, hopefully. I start sweating when we get close to the end of the box if we haven't pulled the autograph yet. I've had a few breaks where it's like the last pack, and I'm just like, geez. Just, it would annoy me so bad if we didn't get one. Ricky Rubio, Terrence Ross, Miles Turner, Mike Conley, Paul Millsap. Got a franchise features, Kawhi Leonard, Cassius Stanley rated rookie. And James Ramsey. And move this stack over here out of the way. Just keep it moving. I hear the rain coming down outside. I gotta film another video after this. I don't usually post like just random box openings, but I'm gonna do one after this break. OG Ananobi, Fred Van Vliet, uh, Bobby Portis, Tyler Hero, Jeff Green. And I think we have another laser for the Heat. Jay Crowder. Tyler Bay, Raider Rookie, and Tyrell Terry. A couple of Mavericks there. Chris Epps, Porzingis. Hassan Whiteside. Uh, Marvin Bagley. Mark Gasol. Derek Jones, Jr. Got a Pokazeski Great Expectations rookie for the Thunder. There's a Jordan War rated rookie and Theo Maladon. Got a couple of Thunder rookies in there. Come on, Ant Man. What do we got? Seven packs to go. John Wall, Nikola Jokic, Davis Rutans, Donovan Mitchell, and Chris Middleton. Green laser is Damian Lillard. That's not bad. And there's an Anthony Edwards. And Kenny Martin Jr. for the Rockets. I guess uh, this, the rookies of this class, their product's all but done printing. I think our last one we had was Mosaic came out. I don't know that we have another one after that. If we do, it's going to be probably some weird off-brand set. I think we're pretty much done with the 2020-21 basketball class product. Otto Porter Jr., Robert Covington, Malcolm Brogdon, uh, D'Angelo Russell. Yeah, you got Mo Bamba. Is this our auto? It's not. Franchise features Nikola Jokic for the Nuggets. You got Elijah Hughes and Robert Woodard. I forgot there was another Kings rookie. You got three, I think, in here. Five packs to go. Glad I put on the other. Goran Dragic. Lou Williams. Uh, Juan Hernan Gomez. Andre Drummond, Evan Fournier, got a green laser, Troy Brown Jr. for the Wizards, Malachi Flynn Raider rookie, and RJ Hampton. Four packs to go. Don't do this to me. Dwayne Bacon, 
Dawnmaker, Langston Galloway. Oh, I think we have a uh, maybe a redemption. It looks like it's too white to be a card. No, it's a card. Okay, I think we have our auto coming up. There's Rui. Let's see who this autograph is. Raptors. Malachi Flynn. The Toronto Raptors. I don't think we had a rookie last time, so it's nice we got a rookie. Oh, I like that. Nice little foil look to it. Oh, his auto is so tiny. He's like trying not to take up any space. <laughs> nice. Nice little card there for the Raptors. Nikola Vucevic, uh, power in the paint insert. Got a Pokazeski ready rookie. And a little beef stew action for the Pistons. Beef stew. Uh, James Harden. Kimball Walker. Jarrett Culver. Uh oh. I don't know if you guys caught that color coming up. Uh, Anthony Davis. Malik Beasley. I thought this was Hornets Blue. It looks like Hornets Blue. I hope it's a green laser Lamello. And we can just cut to the chase here. Yes, 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 yes. Sweet. A raspy voice. I don't know why, but that's awesome. Glad we got that card. That's a tough pull, too, because this is only, I think, the second green laser we've gotten. Rookie-wise. I think the first one was, like, Jalen Smith or something. That's awesome. Very nice. Yeah, I don't think that's like a super short print by any means, but it is a harder card to pull for sure. You have Vernon Carey Jr. and yeah, Yudoka Azubuki. Yeah, I'm glad we got a, a rookie autograph, too. I can't remember who our autograph was last week, but I don't think it was a rookie card. But I also don't remember who it was, so it could have been, I guess. Could have been a rookie card. All right, two packs to go. Still got a couple rookies we're looking for, probably. Markel Fultz, CJ McCollum, uh, Kevin Porter Jr., Rudy Gobert, Eric Bledsoe. We have a Steph Curry, complete players insert. A Devin Vassell, rated rookie for the Spurs. And Obi Toppin for the Knicks. I like both those guys. I like Devin Vassell, too. I think he's going to be all right. Damanis Sabanis. Josh Hart. Wendell Carter Jr. Jarrett Allen. Lonnie Walker. Got a Nemanja by Elisa. Sunburst for the Kings. I can never say his name right. It's it's said way different than it's spelled. Denny Avdia and Onyeka Okongwu. Oh, dang. That's pretty good. That's probably a little higher than I expected. I expected it north of 50, but 100 is real nice. So, I guess you only get two. Well, this time, we only got two rookie uh, green lasers out of the box. So... I mean, that would be a fairly tough card to pull. And if the green laser is exclusive to the retail box, then it just makes it even harder, but I don't know. That's pretty cool. That's 100 bucks is nice. I think at this point with, uh, I mean, if you're in the, if you're in the, in the game of, like, just getting in breaks and if you get a good card flipping it, I don't even know if Graydon's worth it anymore. It's got to be like a pretty decent card to send it in for 50 bucks. I know I've heard they're just still so backed up with stuff. I've still got, I think, a submission that a buddy did for me. It's still out there. All right, let's do a little recap, and then I'll let you guys go. Isaac Coro, Desmond Bain, Emmanuel Quickly, Raider Rookies. Got a Darius Garland, Green Laser, Sadiq Bay. A complete players, Luca. Uh, Miles Bridges, that's the uh, Asia Blue. Got a now playing James Wiseman. 
Asia Blue, Carl Anthony Towns, uh, now playing foil, uh, Patrick Williams, Tyrell Terry, Asia Blue, got a Jason Tatum, uh, 14 of 25, pretty sweet card. Uh, Tyrese Halbert, and we got next insert. This guy, I don't know who this guy is, Leandro Balmaro, double zero for the T-Wolves. I'm not familiar with him, unfortunately, but he's a little Asia Blue rookie there. Lamelo Ball, we got next, and we got a Scotty Pippen Legends of the Ball. A little foil card there. Celtics had a nice card out of that, out of that Asia box, and then the the Bulls did well. Patrick Williams and Scotty Pippen. Yeah, it was a pretty tough break for quite a few teams. Raptors, Celtics did all right. Bulls did okay. And almost everybody at least got their rookies too, I think. Complete players, Steph Curry. Got a Devin Vassell ready rookie. Obi Toppin ready rookie. Denny Avdia. There's the Malachi Flynn signature series for the Raptors. Pokazeski ready rookie. Got the Lamelo Green Laser. Jordan Noir ready rookie. Damian Lillard Green Laser. Anthony Edwards ready rookie. Jalen Smith Green Laser. Joel Embiid Green Laser. Lamelo base Raider rookie Tyrese Maxey, Cole Anthony, Tyrese Halliburton, got a future star or fantasy stars Nikola Jokic, and James Wiseman Raider rookie. So I don't know if I have any more of the Donner's retail boxes. Um, I'll probably try to restructure the break a little bit because those Donner's retail boxes are pretty scripted. It feels like. Um, we did get two Green Laser Raider rookies, but. Uh, just pretty much you get all the 50, 48 or 50 rookies in the set and base cards with some green lasers mixed in. So not a lot of wild potential there. But anyways, I appreciate you guys jumping in. I'm going to do some card sorting and hop off here. But if you don't need anything, just shoot me a message on uh, eBay or Facebook. I'll see if I can help you out. We'll see you later.